Hi and welcome to Tex Nation TV, still covering CES 2015. We're here in Las Vegas, Nevada, here at the Huawei booth. And Robert, let me do this right, Roberto, Roberto, Roberto <laughs> stopped by. And I actually was talking with him a little bit earlier about the Ascend Mate 7, just because it's an amazing phone. We were here last year looking at the Ascend Mate 2, and I had to stop by to see this new flagship phone they got. So if you could tell us a little bit about it and go right ahead. Of course, like you mentioned, uh, this is actually the Huawei Ascend Mate 7. Um, is it it's a very nice phone. Uh, we were talking earlier about it, uh, and uh, as you said, he has a six-inch uh, screen. But um, the best thing about it is that you have a very uh, narrow frame, as you can see right here. Right. And also, um, well, it sports a 13-megapixel shooter in the back. He has a 5-megapixel camera in the front. He has an octa-core, uh, which makes it run really, really smooth. And he has many, many features that I can talk to you about, like for hours, like we just did. Well, one of the cool features, and a lot of a lot of these people are doing this feature now for security purposes, for logging into their phone. I see something on the back of the phone. Tell us about the back of the phone. Yes, yeah, so the back of the phone, right below the camera, you have uh, the fingerprint sensor with an active radio frequency frame, uh, which allows you to do uh, your your un unlocking your phone and uh, waking it up in just one go. You don't have to like wake up your phone and then scan your fingerprint. You do it all in just one go. And that's amazing because if you're used to doing fingerprint scanners with other phones, you obviously know the first thing you have to do is turn the screen on first and then do your thumbprint or finger or whatever it is. Not with this. You can actually just pull your finger up to it and it automatically unlocks it. That's awesome. Now. I know with Android you can support multiple profiles, like you're, you have a work profile and you have a home profile or something like that. Is there any sort of uh, thing that you can do with the, the, the fingerprint there? Definitely. As a matter of fact, yes. Um, it's, it, uh, it holds up to five different fingerprints. And uh, the good thing about it is with each fingerprint, you can have a different profile. We call this the cheater mode. <laughs> <laughs> and it's, and then, well. It, it can save your marriage. Just, maybe just put it that way. Yeah. Say, I mean, you, you always have uh, that problem where your wife says, or, or, or your boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever, right. and says, hey, can I see your phone for a minute? And then you feel just like chills all over your body and everything. <laughs> it's bad. Okay, we can just get rid of that problem uh, by using what we have May 7 because uh, with each uh, fingerprint, uh, could come with a different profile. What I'm trying to say is, uh, say if you want to unlock your phone with this finger, that'll give you your normal profile, and then you got your guest uh, profile with this other finger, which will hide away your, uh, say your WhatsApp, your uh, conversations, your pictures from last night at the casino, <laughs> and so on. So you can hide all that away just by putting it on a different profile. And, and that is good, that is good, believe me, that can save your marriage. <laughs> yeah, and the one thing I did I did like about the phone, and I've always liked with the Ascend phones is, again, he said it there at the beginning, but the screen goes almost edge to edge. It's very thin on the outside. The one thing that, that we compare to is screen size. And with the Note 4, one of the you know popular Samsung Android phones, the screen doesn't go all the way out to the edge. So this is a six inch phone, but the better thing about this one is the screen is a lot larger than what the Note 4 is. They've already told me there's somebody been here with a Note 4 and he's like, your screen's bigger. Yeah. And then they, they did a comparison and by all comparisons, this, this phone beats it. Yes, that is correct. Uh, like you said, um, we have the best screen to body ratio in the market. You only got 17% frame versus, uh, uh, sorry, yeah, 17% frame versus 83% on the screen. So the screen to body ratio is also the best out on the market. Awesome. So you guys go check it out. I've got more square foot to cover here. There's so much more. I see links is down the way. I've got all sorts of things to cover. But that'll be my last one here at the Huawei booth. I've been here, I think, at least about an hour now, it feels like. But either way, go check this phone out. I've got more CES coverage for you. Stay tuned all week. TXTNation.tv.